Hello friends, Gamer Elohim here. In this video, I'm going to be discussing about how to play Revenant effectively. Revenant is the creation of Ikaras Engineers, the first robot tank to be able to teleport directly into the enemy. This is a tanky bot that is able to teleport in front of the enemy, not at the back. So, keeping in mind this strategy, we have to apply some tips and tricks that will help us to play this Revenant much more effectively and it will help us to survive a lot more in the battlefield so first off let's see we should always get extra HP so I'm using retro version or you can use some paint jobs that give you 5% extra health that is always welcome next the next thing is we have to choose weapons that deal a uh, high damage at close range and reload time is very less like for example I'm using hammers 5 second reload time and they reload after firing and they deal huge damage at close range with a less percentage of chance that you'll miss your shots if you aim correctly you won't miss any of your shots and hammers are really good they are new weapons and they do good damage at close ranges up to 300 meters and closer the next thing is i will choose i will also choose punchers because they do uh, high huge damage at close range and they also have five seconds reload time this is for the heavy weapons. Now let's look at the light weapons. I'm using toxins because they have 3 seconds reload time and they are very effective because they have corrosion and they always fire. Like even if your heavy weapons are reloading, toxins will always reload. And if you go to the description, you can also see that it says use. you can use one bane and two toxin in the recommended equipments. So these toxins are really great with Revenant because you are teleporting in front of the enemy, so you have to fire, always fire, otherwise you will die. So, to continuously fire, you should choose weapons that reload fast, and if the reload time is less, that is much more welcome, that is great. New weapons are coming, also with 3 seconds reload time, they are Blight, Decay, and I forgot the mid middle medium weapon name. So these will also have, I guess, 3 seconds reload time and I have to check whether that weapons will also work effectively with this Revenant. Now let's talk about modules. First off, let's choose Repair Amplifier. It is the best module now, guys. It helps your mage to survive a lot more because it can heal the gray damage and also it normally heals all the time heals your bot all the time 0 0.03 bonus regeneration with the entire battle you have to apply uh, like up to 60 the stack and then it will start healing the gray damage as well and your bot will become tankier so this is great with tanks i'm using nuclear amplifier for better damage and the last stand for just a support so that even if i drop down to lost stand i can heal back with active module advanced repair unit this is a best module guys because it heals 10 percent you can see 10 percent hp per second that is a huge hp like you can always get from last stand to almost 60 70 percent of your health you can gain back provided that the gray area can be healed or the the gray area is minimum so the next thing is we should we now look at the pilot skills say increased durability pilot skills always welcome the more durability you have the more you'll survive next thing is very important that you should choose this all active modules on revenant to recharge faster it is very important because you have to always enable the active module i know it is a little bit you can say uh power cell consuming build but you should uh, in the heat of the battle if you do not use healing modules then your then uh, your tanks will die and nothing can be done so active modules are very important and if you have less reload, uh, reload for these modules by using recharge faster skills then it will really benefit you and a next module goes hand in hand to cut down the cost extra cost because it takes 40 power cells for uh, advanced repair unit but it will take only 28 power cells if you use this quartermaster revenant skill all active modules on the revenant cost less power cells to activate this is the thing and next you can go with your favorite skills as well like speed skills increased weapon damage increased more increased durability physical shield 
and many other things you can go and this is Vasilisa, the, I think the only pilot for Rev and it, it repairs some of its durability at the end of the ability. The extent of the repair depends on the damage dealt in the ability. So when you are teleporting toward to some enemy and you are uh, dealing damage, so the amount of damage you do that will be rounded up and your HP will be healed. That means if you deal a huge damage, you will, you will recover a huge HP after the end of the ability. If you deal less damage, you will heal less amount of durability. So these are the things. The next thing which we will talk is uh, about the drones. Okay, let's see what drones we are using. I am using three Parsifons for my three tanks. You can see for Fenrir, Capri and Revenant. I am using three Parsifons. Like I have robots and drones back to back with each other it is very useful bus because i just press two times and drones and bots both are deployed so now let's talk about what microchips we have so this increases the damage output on suppression immune and if you see my other uh, slots then you can see that i'm using that advanced repair unit it increases the damage output for seven seconds so when you're all the time you're using advanced repair you're he not only healing but you're also dealing extra damage so this is a great skill the next skill is when another advanced repair unit it increases the defense system so you get defense points you get 80 defense points for 10 seconds that is really viable and it helps you to survive the huge firepower in front like you can also survive titans if you have perfect modules and perfect all everything then you can survive titans as well now another one advanced advanced repair unit defense system for 10 seconds so 88 choose a 160 defense points for 10 seconds it really makes a super huge you know a tank there for the revenant it, the revenant becomes a huge tank with these sockets and the most important socket is the f type socket and it is really useful not i'm not say it is really very important most important but the tanks really benefit from this microchip because otherwise it is not useful in bots having low health like orochi harpies and sirens if you can make those bots tankier with durability skills and modules and all the stuff then it's good but if you're using basic level bots that has a very less hp then it is not recommended but it is always useful to use uh, this <laughs> when you get 70,000 damage within 5 seconds it activates absorber this is on mild damage absorber and we also have a chip that is on high damage absorber that comes a bit less frequently but that can also work so all the things you have to keep in mind before playing any tank and here in this case we are talking about revenant so you have to keep in mind all the things everything makes any build stronger all the things are required now let's look at my the orbital motherships i am using mantis it has two turrets one turret is the repair blast station it heals it repairs your durability make sure that you remain in the circle of the area of effect of orbital strikes otherwise you will not get the healing you will only get the aegis shield because healing this one this comes a little bit less delay before strike you can see two seconds but after two seconds as well you, you can see that your bot starts to keep healing the next one is we have the aegis blast system it gives you aegis shield okay so this also helps you to make your tanks survive a lot more and when you're firing point blank you fill up the mothership bar much faster and you can be you'll be able to see that your tanks are surviving a lot more so these are the strategy that is required to survive and now the, the, the last but not the least thing which you have to keep in mind is when you are teleporting you should always make sure that your weapons are reloaded if your weapons aren't reloaded and you teleport in front you cannot fire fire anything then it is a waste of time it is a waste of your strategy resources everything so what basically you should do that will make you survive a lot more is you have to select on any target and uh, targets see another revenant is coming and i'm activating my healing 
and see as you can see that this revenant is also using some healing stuff that helps him survive but what makes me all in advantageous position is that I'm using all the perfect skills that I require see my two of the slots are gone but I am still surviving and he is dying I think he is pretty leveled up but he is not using the top notch our uh, the pilot skills drones and all these things everything is important and do not heal now because I'm not healing now and I'm, re I'm just seeing that if my things are reloaded and when I teleport to someone then I will start healing see even without healing I got healed back because of the precision drone so like this you can save a lot of your power shields as well you use the healing module you know why not because of uh, recovering HP but because to counter the enemy's firepower yeah that is the main thing if you want to know more tips and tricks you can check my tips and tricks playlist also I have given some great tips and tricks that you able to become a pro in no time so make sure you check that ah we can see the uh, party siren yes. uh, I think yeah it's a party See, my legs are damaged, but I'm still surviving because of the drones and the pilots. Now, I'm using this ability to counter my enemy's firepower and gain some resistance for myself. So let's see if he can survive. He already froze me. I'm frozen. He is having good... Uh, what he's using is using paralysis. It's a great role causing very much problems. are very fast annoying shit I do not like this point blank attack has become very difficult now I don't know why I cannot survive much easily in point blank he's sure he's using emulator he's using emulator to play 100% sure to dodge my bullets. Go oh, die die now. Please die. The time is over. Over smart. Using blaze. What the fuck? Now let's show him his place. You are using meta. Bullshit. is using these fucking sirens and tanking and dying this free for all mode has become a tanking ground not like to play free for all very disturbing very annoying he's using orochi Tear something, man? You wanna tear something? You can't. <laughs> okay, now he's coming up with a blue chat or activating. If I have two meter and if I have two meter, I can do it. Let's deploy our... Deploy the such... Yeah. He is at 800 meters, man. Why do they deploy so far away from the heat of the battle? So that I do not get much kills. is gone. I think the Lucha is left. Oh no, the, I, I told the opposite. 
drop splash corrosion. Now, utilizing reflector defense, let's heal back some of the HPs and let's hit this again. Wow, so many things are happening all the time. I'm going down to a faster. Again, this annoying smoothers. Oh, goodbye. Goodbye, dude. Again, this annoying capri. Constant. Let's deploy our Ravana. It's not that always you have to deploy the same bots all the time. You should counter your enemies. See? He's standing in that place. What a waste of time, man. Cannot heal back. That is the thing. And the thing is, you should fire like one, two, three, one, two, three, like this. He is having repairs now. But these revenants are much powerful to take now. Still now. Yes. I've got that. Got that. That's a competition right there. Shooting at the general direction to counter the stealth. And he's out of stealth. Boom. Again, I think he's having RP. Oh, no, 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 no. This is a Hellburner, I guess. Hellburner, I think, or maybe a heart. I don't know. Okay, so that is a harpy. It was running very fast. So everyone is firing at me apparently. Everyone is focusing on me. Bye! Sixteen seconds left. Can we hit some shots for them? Let's move faster. This ability makes you move faster for five seconds. Six seconds left to the battle, and I think I will not. Uh, no, okay, hard place. Let's see how much damage we did. I guess we did 5 million something damage. Let's see our stats. Uh, 7 million, that's good damage. 7 million damage, wow. Six kills. A general Vas, Champion League. Champion League, I am Master League. Master 2, Master 2, Master 1. That's good. The, that was a challenging battle. And I hope you liked, understood the strategy to play the Revenant. Always make sure to reload before uh, teleporting in front. That is the final thing. And drones, modules, pilots, all the things are very important in order to make your Revenant survive much more and squeeze out as much benefits as possible from that bot. That's a great bot. And that, thanks for your suggestion, my friend. So this is the video, and I hope you like it. If you liked, please uh, leave a like and subscribe. Subscribe to two or three accounts <laughs> and share with your friends. Thank you, guys. Catch you in the next video. Peace out.